Kern County voters may get a chance to make medical marijuana legal in the county. That's after the Board of Supervisors banned it last year. There's a group that's trying to overturn the ban by putting it on the November ballot. Eyewitness News reporter Kristen Powers tells us what they need to do. Kristen? Hey, David Rochelle, a group of medical marijuana advocates want to take the decision out of the hands of the supervisors and give it to the people. They filed an initiative with the county, but still need to gather a little more than 13,000 valid signatures by June to get it on the ballot. Walking into the county clerk's office, Heather Epps and Jeff Jarvis are one step closer to finalizing an initiative measure for the November ballot that would ask voters to overturn Kern County's medical marijuana ban. I think there's a general consensus, and at least we believe there is, that the county made an error in their approach to cannabis. Both Epps and Jarvis are with Kern Citizens for Patient Rights, or KCPR. Local attorney Phil Ganong wrote the initiative, but these two have been working to dot their I's and cross their T's to get county approval before they can start collecting signatures. We're pushing this forward really thinking in terms of safe access for the patients that require it. To have a band in Kern County forces these individuals to have to travel 50, 60, 75 miles to receive medicine or to be able to purchase medicine. If voters approve the initiative, I'm confident we have a chance. Medical marijuana dispensaries would be allowed in Kern County. Recreational still wouldn't. The whole thing is about regulated and safe access to medicine for patients as well as protecting our community. Regulatory is extremely important with the zoning. We want to make sure that the shops are not in neighborhoods that if they are growing they're in you know the right zone district for it. In the proposed ordinance commercial activity like growing, manufacturing, testing and selling would be allowed and it does not limit the number of permits that can be issued in the county. I believe the mindset in Kern County is not only changed but is ready for this and accepts this. The group already got